Hi guys, welcome to our GB Mobile demo for table side ordering. Uh, this particular application is good for the retailer, specifically designed for different environments out in the field. For example, if you are a quick serve restaurant and you want to do some quick ordering on the menu, doing it on a handheld versus a paper and pen. Another way this can be used out is in resort locations, say for example, beachfront uh, service. So I'll run through some quick examples of how this particular app is going to work. So in this case, um, we'll look at the main screen here. It's a sample guest check. As you can see, it's that it's blank. There's no items to the order. You could do a little bit of role playing here. Imagine that I'm your waiter. I'm going to go ahead and create a new order. First thing I'll do is take down your name. In this case, I'm servicing Chi. And I'll ask Chi, does this person want some drinks? Maybe you want a nice cold iced tea? Click on large, say done, get you one iced tea. Also, maybe uh, let's say a cup of coffee for the person next to you. Choose one coffee there, say done, and then we'll complete that order. I'll come back and say, and if you want any sandwiches, I can order some sandwiches now. Since I'm going to pick something healthy, I'll say some tuna fish, maybe a whole tuna fish sandwich, and we'll get two of those. One for you and your partner. Complete. Maybe also put in some notes. So, for example, uh, I'll say on my tuna fish, I want light mayo as my note. Save that. Click on done. Go ahead and tally that. You can see that my item list is already. Uh, Populated now, you can see that I have an iced tea here, medium coffee, and two tuna fish sandwiches. I can always go back and modify this order if I need to, add more items, let's say some extra condiments, for example. But in this case, I'll just choose to process the order. So I'll say process order now. Um, by default, we ask to put a tip, and this is like the tip that I would request. Have the person sign off, click on continue and choose a payment method. A club account, again, going back to the resort example, perhaps you have some charge card that you keep with you all the time, I can use that and swipe that card to get your uh, payment details. Or in this example, I'll just use a credit card. I'll say go, and you can see to the left of this device is a mobile printer. And I'll go ahead and swipe using this printer instead. Click on process, and I'll begin by swiping this card and capturing information. And that might make sense if I did it the right way. As you can see here, you have the option to print a receipt. I'll click on no just to kind of finalize the transaction. Say done, and you can see that it's gone. So theoretically what's happening now is once I capture the information, it's hitting the POS system back at the restaurant. It's going to go ahead and tally up, ready up that order so somebody can prepare it and then go back and get it, and everything's paid for and taken care of.